everybody today we are back with a new requirement that we have to add a resort page inside our existing mvc application so this is my brand new mvc application you can log into my folders from the solution explorer window and here there's only one controller and here are my views the default views shipped with the template so what i need to do is i have just two requirements to set up in startup.cs number one let's add the service here inside configure services let's add the support for services dot add uh, resort pages done the second thing is we need to map resort pages inside our endpoints okay map resort pages so that's it so we are done with our requirements inside startup.cs now we can use resort pages in our application save this file close it and let's create a folder pages because by default resort pages routing look for its pages inside pages folder so here we just created a pages folder at the root of our application along with controller model views and here is residing our pages and now i'm going to create a new page here by adding a resort page and but i'm not going to give it a name index.cshtml the reason is it is conflict with mvc index uh, page so here i'm going to give it a name my um, resort page for example my resort page okay so uh, i'm just copying this name as well to easily run inside my explorer okay here i added my resort page okay there we go and here i'm just adding an um, heading um, welcome to resort page okay and just save it and here my application mvc uh, application is running with the layout of default mvc application and i'm just going to give the name my resort page okay so there we go this is our resort page but without any layout so what we need to bring the layout here same as we do in our any uh, resort page uh, we need to either uh, specify the view start file or we can specify the layout from here as well layout okay uh, but from where this layout will be fetched from the views of mvc and our layout is placed inside layout.cshtml okay this layout file will be uh, applied to our resort page okay let's don't believe on me okay let me give it a try okay there we go here is our mvc application layout okay let me show you okay mvc app layout let me give it a refresh there you can see it yourself mvc app layout so this is my resort page but calling the layout of mvc but if you want to specify a separate layout for resort page you can how the same way as we do in our resort page applications let's come inside our pages and add a shared folder where we'll add our um, layout shared and there i'm going to copy a layout file okay layout.cshtml the same name not necessary you can change the name but for now i'm specifying the same name okay here what i'm going to give is i'll simply uh, write heading h1 uh, resort page layout a very bad looking layout i'm going to create here not recommended and here i'm just going to call render body okay after the hr or this page will be called on this location uh, save and refresh hmm. you can see it by yourself that this is the layout now from uh, resort pages i haven't changed anything inside my page 
I have just specified layout and I'm conflicted with the resort page layout and MVC layout but resort page uh, routing first looked for the layout inside the resort shared folder otherwise if it's not find there your layout from the MVC shared folder will be applied so what we are going to do next if you want to specify the okay let me um, just delete uh, rename it here okay I'm going to rename the layout from shared folder no let's see what happens okay we are back to MVC layout okay what I'm going to change here is uh, we have a menu of home and privacy and now I'm going to add the name of our resort page here inside MVC because MVC's layout is applied and here I'll add the link at this point so what I'll do is just I'll write the code as it's written for resort page there it is and you can see uh, I have just added ASP dash page the same way we uh, create our menus inside resort pages I'm not going to write ASP dash controller I am I've just written ASP dash page and here is the name of my page and the heading the title that I want to give for this hyperlink and if I save it and refresh it there we go so here is my page and welcome privacy my resort page all are linked together but the last thing what will happen if I also have an index file inside resort pages so let's do that uh, what's happening now if I'm not specifying any name here the home controllers and tax action is taking the route is taking the URL okay uh, but if I'm going to specify a page here with the same name in index.cshtml In this case, there will be a conflict and the priority will be given to your resort page. Okay, so the priority then in that case will be given to your resort page. But if you don't have any index page, index.cshtml inside your pages folder, URL will be routed to your home controller uh, inside index. Okay. So that's it for this session. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to press the bell icon. Thank you.